Hey guys, so today I'm doing the roommate tag with my roommate, Lillian. So, um, she, she kind of didn't want to do this. <laughs> she yeah. was kind of worried about this, but I made her do it because, well, I wanted you guys to meet her because she's a really cool roommate. I'm kind of excited. Yeah, Sabrina forced me to do this. <laughs> so, uh. she did it. <laughs> I'm such a good persuader. Not really, but, um, we wanted to do one, and I told you guys I was really worried about, you know, my roommate and things, but it turned out that I have a really cool roommate, so I want you guys to get to know her better, so let's get into the questions. Um, the first one is, did you guys know each other before you became roommates? No, definitely not. No, I didn't, no, because we're like on different sides of our state, so, or not different, we're not really close together, but at the same time we're different sides, so um, we're like 30 minutes away, I think, so we never actually met. But we did talk on the phone before we got here, yes. so I got to know her a little bit. All right. What did you guys initially think of each other the first time you met? Um, I thought she was very similar to me. We're both, we both are like foreign. So yeah. That definitely, yeah, we are. That definitely connected us together. But I actually thought that she was quite similar to me. Yeah, me too. And I was excited because we liked the same things and kind of did the same things and. Um, I was like worried that we wouldn't go to bed earlier. <laughs> I was like, my roommate's gonna be a partier, and I'm gonna be like, go to yeah, bed. a party. <laughs> but we we are a lot alike, so I was very happy. Um, how long did it take until you guys became friends? Um, it was probably during the honors retreat. It was just like a couple days after we had moved in. Yeah. Pretty much the entire time, we always stayed together and shared a room together also there so yeah because we um, we didn't really talk until we got to the retreat and then we got to know each other really well and it was fun we had lots of fun on that yeah, yeah. <laughs> so a lot of stuff happened <laughs> yes um, let's see what do you guys usually argue about um, I think the biggest <laughs> argument we've had was over milk. <laughs> we have a little mini fridge in our room, uh -huh. and we were going to, we were just going down to the store to buy some milk for some cereal. <laughs> and I thought we could agree on this, but apparently not. Sabrina drinks nasty fat-free <laughs> milk, and I drink the normal 2%. So we could definitely, <laughs> yeah, we had to buy our own milks and carry it up to back to the room. So yeah. that's definitely going to be an issue between us for the rest of the year. We're just going to have to buy our own milk. But, yeah. Um, other than that, we don't really argue about anything. We've been, um, you know, really been good. Pretty good so yeah. far. <laughs> Any more water milk? I might ruin it. <laughs> yeah, I call her milk water milk. It's gross. It's good. What is one thing that really bothers you about you that your roommate does? I've yet to like notice anything because I feel like we are so similar in the fact that like we go to sleep at the same time yeah. and we wake up around the same time and like we just really stick to our contract agreement yeah. about like studying or if we want to stay in here and like talk on the phone we'll try to make sure that the other person isn't like disturbed by yeah. it. So. So getting like a roommate agreement or making a contract, whatever you guys need, it's a good idea because then you guys can like stick to it. Yeah. Make sure you guys know what you don't or do like. Um, do you guys both have the same passion for makeup? Um, I definitely have a lower expertise, <laughs> like expert level, than Sabrina does, but I actually do know some things about makeup. Yeah. I watch some YouTube channels also. Like I was excited to watch Emily, that. <laughs> Emily Noel is my person, and like Leanne says, and so those are the people that I watch mainly. So she's like, I know what you're doing. Yeah, you're not a that little. weird. <laughs> a little bit. And I got to see her like makeup collection, so we like bonded yeah. over makeup. Yeah. <laughs> um, who spends the most time getting ready in the morning? Probably me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> not by much though. We probably like throw ourselves together in the morning <laughs> yeah, I'm before like, class. Who needs makeup? Just put clothes on, go yeah, to school. Pretty, pretty much. much. Just be covered. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, well, college is a little bit more different. It's not like you're expected to actually look okay. Some people just show up wearing PJs, so, yep. you know, whatever you want to wear here. It's very comfy. Um, what was something that you two didn't notice about each other until you became roommates? Hmm. Well, I didn't know that Lily liked to listen to rap music. It's kind of surprising because yeah. she doesn't seem like the type of she does and, you know, she'll listen yeah. to some cool rap music. Yeah, I do listen <laughs> to rap music. I'm glad that Sabrina's open to listening to it. I used to listen to it all the time when I was younger, so, like, I like it too. Yeah, and I think the 
thing that I probably didn't notice until I started living with her was like how close she is to her sister. Like they call each other at least like every day and definitely text each other. It's nice to see that but they like are definitely still close. Yeah, I miss her. Hey Squish, if you're watching this, I miss you. <laughs> All right. Um, do you guys sometimes get fed up with each other from seeing each other too often? I mean, I'm used to it. Like I, like you guys know that Alex and I were really close, so she was always in my room and you know there with me. But um, I don't get fed up. So far, I'm okay with it. Yeah, and I definitely agree with that. Like I'm pretty okay with it being having a roommate or if I really do need space I'll just go out into the hall and study we yeah, have a lot of rooms we have, here yeah that's really cool and there's a lot of like quiet spaces too so I haven't really had any issues all right um how do you avoid tension while living together we follow that contract <laughs> mm -hmm. we definitely <laughs> stick to that contract just about if one of us is studying or if we're both studying then depending on where we want to stay or what we're doing we'll go out one of us will stay in here we can still both stay in the room but it's just like following that contract and just like being open to like how you want to study and what you want to do at what times yeah so it's good to know always have a contract <laughs> <laughs> um what's one rule you guys have while living together well i don't know just just, you know, try to be nice to each other, try to respect each other. Yeah. You know, definitely. one person wants to do something, just let them do it. Mm -hmm. Give them their space. I don't know, you know. Yeah. Just have to be in agreement. Like, I don't know, some people get in fights about not, just not following their own rules or whatever they set up at the beginning of the year. So just make sure you do and you'll be okay. I mean, it's only been a week, but I think we're going to be okay for the rest yeah. of the year. Yeah. I'm, I have hope. I yeah, have hope. me too. <laughs> um... How do you deal with sharing a bathroom? I'm okay with it. I shared a bathroom with my sister and... Yeah, I'm used to it too. I shared bathrooms with people before in my family. Yeah, I'm it's not normal. cool enough to have my own bathroom ever. But whatever. No, I <laughs> um, do you make two separate dinners at night? No, we go to like our little thing down there and Yeah, food. we have like this cafeteria style <laughs> She's so tired place. of it. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting a little bit tired of it, but we don't have any kitchens on our yeah. halls or anything, so we, have one we always have to go. We can't really use that unless we rent it yeah, out. So. so we always have to go off of, out of our dorms to eat. And sadly the food's not that healthy over there. It's really good, but... Yeah. <laughs> you have to Pasta. pick and choose. You have to pick and choose. Yes, yeah. So we're, we're also working out though, so we're not going to gain that freshman 15, we'll be fine. Yes. We Nationalities. Well, as we had mentioned at the beginning, we're both foreign. Yes. I'm Hungarian. And I'm Romanian. We're neighboring <laughs> countries. Yes. If you guys ever want to look on a map, mm -hmm. you'll see that we're next to each other. And so. I visited Hungary and it's so pretty, so um, I know where she's from and yeah. she lives in a beautiful area, so... Yeah, it's really fun to have somebody that's, you know, we kind of understand each other that mm -hmm. way. Our families are all crazy and make yeah. lots of food. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Definitely can relate. Do you use your roommate's things without asking? Um, it hasn't happened. No, we no. usually, I don't even, we haven't really had to ask because we haven't done anything that requires yeah. that, but you steal her mirror all the time. That's pretty much it, you know. <laughs> yeah. Nothing, nothing else so besides much. that. Um... What is your favorite things that you like to do with each other? Workout? Yes. <laughs> Good to have a workout, but Yes, it does help. Like, you're more motivated. Like, yeah. I don't like being there by myself. It's lonely. <laughs> and I, yeah, I agree with that. And I also like to go out and try new places with her. Mm -hmm. I force her to get out of the whole cafeteria situation because she loves that place. I just love it. So I've have, been like, trying to, like, pull her other places and, like, let's go here instead. But yeah, I finally had Starbucks today. Doing. It was really good. <laughs> That's good. That's gonna be a big thing because it's on campus, but it's really far away, so we're like too lazy to go over there. So. Yeah, you definitely need to know why you're going there <laughs> yeah. in the first place. Um, what happens when one person gets sick? Well, we haven't gotten sick yet, but if we do get sick, we'll probably just like help each other and take care of each mm -hmm. other. If anybody needs anything, we'll go out and get something. So yeah, we'll take care of each other like sisters. Caring, <laughs> caring, it's good. Have you thought about having pets or a pet? We're not really allowed to. So. Yeah, we're not allowed to. So. And we don't really want to fish. No. Because <laughs> there's not enough room in here. So. No. Yeah. Oh well. Um. What is the funniest thing you've done together? 
Do you want to tell the story? Ooh. Okay, we, well, coming back from the honors retreat, we just had all of our sleeping bags, all of our clothing. So we had a bunch of like bags that we had to carry back to our dorm. And while we were going back, there were just like a bunch of cars that like stopped us and we were like, what are you guys, yeah. where are you guys coming from? Like, this is such a crazy thing for people <laughs> to carry people. things. But none of them helped, of mm -mm. course. None of them like decided to like help us anyway. But it was pretty funny, like the things they yelled at us and like trying to like call us out from their cars. Yeah, and, like, we were crossing in the traffic. street, and they're like, "What are you guys? What are you guys carrying over there?" Like we came from the honors retreat, and they're like, "Oh my gosh, you guys are nerds!" And then they started like screeching and shouting yeah. and beeping. I'm like, "Whoa, what's?" Yeah, what? I was like, like, just like, "Let's just go. <laughs> let's quickly. just run away." She's let's like, "I'm not associated leave. with you, Sabrina." <laughs> I didn't know they'd react like that. That was really weird. Yeah, it was. And other than that, just like going out, like we went to like a little party thing. At our, like it's not really a party because we're not party goers, but it's like a little activities at our school. Mm -hmm. And we went to that and we took like funny pictures and had ice cream. Ice and like cream. Cold stone. Good so ice good. cream. Oh good goodness. ice cream. Yes. And we got, I got a glitter tattoo. Yeah, mine's starting to come off. <laughs> it just looks like black marks everywhere. <laughs> and that was like a lot of fun. So we enjoyed ourselves. Um, let's see. The last question is, has being roommates helped or hurt your relationship? It's helped a lot. Yeah. yeah. I definitely think it's helped. Like, some people say don't be best friends with your roommate, but I actually enjoy being friends with my roommate. Yeah, yeah, like, I agree <laughs> to that, because it just makes it a lot more comfortable to be in here. Yeah, and, like, and go places you're not scared places. to go by yourself, mm -hmm. and you have somebody to do things with, so... Yeah. We have been enjoying it. So, this is it for our roommate tag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And um, hope you had fun making it with me. Yeah, it was, it was okay. <laughs> so we'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye.